okay guys so this is the second part of the studio setup where in the first part we did the cable management and in the second part we are going to set up the desk it's a normal computer desk as you can see it's no fancy desk or anything for this water we require it's the same thing actually we need a table mat which will act as a mouse pad as well as uh, for keeping your keyboard and other things we do require some of the sticky cable managers in case we are going to attach any audio interface over here and I'm using a normal keypad which is a stream deck alternative which I'm using to control my OBS I'm going to fix that also and we will just be lighting this up using this RGB strip it comes with a 12 wall adapter which we'll be able to go ahead and connect over here so it will be coming around over here and we'll be using this to place our audio interface that is the, uh, the audio interface which I use is this one Mona. and we'll be keeping all our stuff back on this desk as you can see a big clutter over here everything from this desk will be going back over here let it be the mic let it be whatever is uh, like a clutter over there like we'll be shifting it back over here so that's what we're going to do in this video so let's go ahead and first stick on this rgb and let's start setting up but before going ahead and doing that first we'll place this mat and then i'll show you after i place the mat and all the items how it looks at the moment you can just see it's just a plain desk over here how it's looking and after i place the mat and put on the rgb and keep all this cluttered stuff this one and this one i'll be able to go ahead and show you how this is looking so let's go ahead and start with that okay guys if you see over here i have gone ahead and placed a mat as i had told you before and this mat you can keep your mouse keyboard and even the numerical pad over here and all the wires are going under the mat so there is no problem it is very clear over here that mat will not be causing any problem because it covers the wire and in the audio interface you can see all the wires are connected like the speaker the mic and everything is connected and the speaker wire is going from behind the monitor and it's coming towards the side and there's also a usb over there a usb port uh, manager which will be useful to go ahead and attach them and if you see over here there is the headphone where i can monitor it and there is the mic and the keyboard and even the obs controller which i am just using a normal control pad for that numerical pad and this is the simplest way i have set up the front side of my desk with the speaker and everything kept over there in the back you can go ahead and see there's the RGB connected over here and I put the ring in between because we don't need to cut that and it is it has been connected to the junction box also for the RGB to work properly to give a good effect and above you can see all the wires are going inside the visa mount once we push this desk back it will be more neat and clean because nothing will be seen over here as you can see down all the wires are going in a straight line so if you see this uh, this is how it looks after the rgb is turned on it looks kind of good and uh, we'll be tying those wires by a zip tie so that there won't be any problem and the only wire hanging out there is that table's wire so we don't have to worry about it but when this table goes a little bit more behind this table will give a proper RGB look till the top 
so that's one advantage we are getting over here and the table is well clean now without any problem and if you see over here there's a headset stand also which has been kept over here and even over there there's RGB so RGB is the totally everywhere without any problem so that's so that's the simplest way we can go ahead and set this up and uh, you see so many wires over here but uh, you won't be having so many wires because I do have what five cameras attached and I have an audio interface so so many wires are going by but you won't be having so many wires to be worried about and I'll be going ahead and controlling this with the zip tie over here just like the below one but uh, if you just have one camera or anything there's not a problem and when you keep your DSLR over the visa mount even that will not be seen the wires coming out and once we push the desk behind all the wires will be going behind the visa mount and it can be zip tied to that easily and this is the easiest way you can set it up because the mat over here it's the best thing you can do and this is the easiest way you can go ahead and set your setup with no additional things required. So go ahead and try this out with just one camera you're trying in there will not be any problem at all. So best of luck.